Hold on, hold on, hold on. What is going on here? Captain's log. I have done some examination of this grub that I have received. And it looks like I need to do something, but I need to return to one of the vile brood planets, or at least wait until the next one. Some interesting properties with it. But, for now, I, there are two moons that I would like to explore in this system. I'm not very interested in the glitch planets. What I need to see are the two more habitable worlds. Alright, so we've got an infested planet, which I am not interested in. So, first of all, the moons. Are over there. So this world is a... Uh, desert moon and this one here scanner's not getting it I'm getting interference all right first is Paonia U12 let's take a look at this and see what we've got with this one ah oh, that's not what I meant to do just keep going 20 seconds. There's a high sentinel activity on this world. I'm not too concerned about that. I'm only there to take a look at it. Reddish in color. All right. I want to deal with the daytime. All right, entering the atmosphere. So far, got a bit of an orange hue and some wind. Ah, buffering everything. All right. Whoa. Sand blowing everywhere. What in the world is this? Huh, odd rocks. Hold on. Ah, oh, the sandstorm is awful. Let's get out of here. Take a look. I'm not sure if there are any predators around. Let me get up here. Windy! Alright, this is... not pleasant. I can hardly see anything. All right, launching drone. Is there anything I can see around here? It's not much more than a very dusty world. Not interested in staying. I'll check out the other moon. Alright, where is it? That's the planet. No, the other moon's on the other side. Over there. There it is. What do we got? Sovake 10, it is an arid moon. Gray, is there a storm on there right now? Alright, we do have a storm. We're entering the atmosphere. There's a window in the clouds here. Oh! So much ash. Oh, wow. I 
can hardly see with this storm. Get down to the ground to see if I can. Um, the visibility is awful. All right, let me just get another drone up in the air and see what's going on here. It's like everything's burning. Oh wow. That is incredible. This is this is almost an alien world. Well, it is. Out. Oh. Okay. I just got out. Oh, wonderful. This is incredible. Ninety-three degrees is not too bad. <laughs> oh, we've got one of these critters here. Hmm. Wow. What is that? Oh, good. Oh, hello. You are safe. I just want to take a look over here. Now that everything's cleared up, but oh wow. It's a plant. Ugh, fermented corpses. It's volcanic in nature. Water transport on this world? It's ash absolutely everywhere. Huh. Oh. Okay. It's like uh, these were volcanic cores at one time. How strange. They're almost like they're burning. Yet they're alive. And these ones too. Far reaching rock enzymes. Ah. Hello, hello. All right. Well, it was interesting checking out this moon. Let's move on. In fact, we're going to another system. I need to find one of those vile brood planets. All right, Kamakura, come in. Let's go. I'm getting closer to the center of the galaxy. Less than 10,000 light years. Alright everyone, we're moving on. Center is that direction. Hold on, we do have an atlas. Atlas interface. We don't have any fuel. Hmm. Okay. Now we can go. A dissonant system, but uh, no, I want to go farther as far as I can. Another dissonant system, okay, we're going far here. An F 
F-class si system. E, F, water, botulmol. Let's check this one out. It's only three planets, but we're getting closer. All right, we've arrived. First contact. Just three planets. Not much to check out here. Activating planetary probe. Oh. Okay, Lilero 9 is airless. Lepicor. Humid planet. Ivy Bar J38 is a poisonous planet. I want to check out these two. Especially Lepicor. No vile... No vile brood yet. Hmm? Where does my ship... There they moved my ship. They did. Alright. Maybe a good idea to check in at the space station, which is right in front of me, right there. Okay. There's a couple of shuttles in here. Oh, they're gone now. I'm eventually going to have to send out some more expeditions. Alright. Let's see what you've got. Mm, you don't have what I'm looking for. It's alright. Not looking for any upgrades at the moment either. Let's check out these planets. Hold on. Hold on. You have a wing I want. Let's see. To make an offer on your starship. I don't care the price. You watch Pioneer 7. Let's buy that. And I'm gonna scrap this thing. That that's a part that I want. So that is the right wing. I'm going to need a left wing as well. Alright, let's salvage. Salvage analysis complete. Select desired operation, extract high value scrap metals, or harvest reusable customization module. Let's extract the customization module. It will be destroyed. Uh, I need the right wing. Right. So it's glider wing. Check my inventory. There it is. The glider wing. I need... That's the hull. I need the right wing now. Oh, there's a... Uh, a traveler. Hmm. Okay, let's check out the planets now. So which one do we have here? That's the airless planet, not the one I'm interested in. 
that one, though. That's the poisonous one. Let's take a look at that one first. Ivy Bar J38. No Sentinels. Should be safe. Interesting colors. And it's ringed. Huh. Alright. Aim for that region. Alright. Adjust trajectory. It's fairly green. That's not bad. All right, let's land here. Interesting creatures. What are these things? Let's launch the drone and check these out. Variety of colors. Yellow and purple. Hmm. Very interesting. It's... Wait, what is that over there? There's something over there. I need to go take a look. In that direction. I saw it. Hold on. I'm not seeing it. Ah, okay. I think it was just one of those pillars. Oh! I just fell into a little crater. What in the world is this? This is a mineral. Huh. Salt bonding, electromagnetic. Wait a minute. Is this structure a monolith? 581 meters in that direction. There's another structure. An unknown building. I'll go that way. Take a look at that one first. If it's even interesting. I don't even know. Weird. Strange creatures in this world. was that? Hold on. These. What are you? Sentient plant. Oh, no. Okay. Not something I should have done. The ship is in that direction. Let's head back in that direction. Uh, they'll continue searching for me. I'm not in the mood to fight. Ah, there we go. I guess I'm not going over there. Just take a quick hop over there. Oh, it's just right here. Here. What a strange location for it. Hmm. 
Hmm. What? Faster. Away. Drink. Ruins of man. The monolith shows images of creatures lying dead before it, each sacrifice butchered and offered up to whatever gods were once worshipped here. The command of the Viking ancients, sacrifice the beast, blood for Herc. Suddenly, the head of a small woodland animal raises up through the earth below me. It stares at me with wide eyes, then gives a joyful skip when its tiny hooves reach ground level. Something is clearly expected of me. Sacrifice the creature. I blast the woodland animal in two. The monolith conjures a powerful wind, roaring its appreciation as the vision fades. I'm left with a gift. Atlas word for sea. Viking would want sacrifice. All right. Makes perfect sense. I've seen enough here. That's got to be the other planet there. Lepicor. It is. This one will probably be the more interesting one, possibly. 32 seconds until arrival. Starbulb copper paraffinium. Magnetized ferrite. Magnetized ferrite means that it will have storms. Being alert for my settlement as well. They're going to have to wait. All right. The two stars of this system. Green and red. That is an unusual pair. All right, I can see the planet on the side here. Turn around in a moment. Okay, let's take a look. Fairly cloudy in this region, so let's head down there. Teal Oceans, Red Land. Huh. Not the most interesting. Oh, and there's a transmission tower. Or a hollow tower, I guess. Not interested in that. Oh, hello. It's a crashed freighter here. Oh, that's a great place to land. A wonderful navigation system. I'm almost more interested in the cave. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. What's going on? Oh. All right. Should have landed in a better location. Like over here. Let's take a look and see what kinds of things we can find in here. Uh, 
don't know if this is a good one or not. Okay, residual goop and rusted metal. What have we got? Silicate powder. Multi-tool expansion slot. This is decent. Let's see what other cargo this ship had. Had once I've finished. Oh, there we go. Still need the uh, terrain manipulator. Residual goop and rusted metal. Salvage data. That'll be useful as well. There it is. Anything else useful? Warp hypercore. Yeah, I'll take that too. Extreme subterranean radiation detected. Hmm. Extreme radiation detected. Yeah, I get it. What do we have with this? Another hypercore. I'm fine with free fuel. And this one? Salvage data. All right. Extreme subterranean radiation detected. There's some decent cargo in this ship. I'm glad I decided to stop here. There's the last one here. But I don't think I'm going to stick around on this planet, to be honest. Neural duct. Well, that's uh, money for you. Such an. I don't know. Sure, it's a humid planet, but it's not beautiful. find anything beautiful about this planet. Hold on. What kind of oceans are we dealing with here? Look at all the... Wow! Alright. Just gonna quickly land here. Unusually large collection of knowledge stones. Worlds. Expected. No, that was not expected. And coming. You are safe. I wanted to take a look at the ocean. You're safe too, I believe. Yeah, you don't look like a predator at all. Oh. Wow. This is beautiful. Sometimes. You hit the jackpot with these uh, sunsets.
Oh, and it's bioluminescent. I love bioluminescent worlds. Should have known with all the uh, the fungal life here. Yet it's not a fungal planet. Yeah, we've got a predator there. Okay. My ship is just right up here, so... Time to go. Okay, I need to know what's in the next six, uh, next system. Any vile brood planets? We'll see. I don't want to. I don't want to go back. Keep going forward. All right. Uh, let me see if how much fuel I've got. Oh, yeah, that's a good amount. 2,000 tons. You know what? Next six, uh, next system, let's send some missions out. First of all, where's the center? There it is. That's too far now. Nogawa. Decent number of planets. Four planets. Water. Viking again. All right, let's warp. First contact. It's been a while since I've visited a system that was discovered by someone else. Alright, activating planetary probe. Aris. A flourishing planet. Very red. Horin Kuze. Fungal, fungal mold. No. Uh, caustic nightmare. I'm not going there. Nograt, Nogratfi V18. Terraforming Catastrophe and Tefipo. Another fungal planet. Okay. There is that one world that I would like to look at. Ah, Hivateran. Good to see you. I'd like to send out some missions. Ah, Traveler Entity. Corvax is pleased to report exciting navigational research. Corvax has plotted new expeditions for your fleet. Okay, let me take a look at them. Ah... Let's take a look at this high value on uh, trade expedition. Although I would like to do the balanced first. So let's take a look at it. Upatel's lost cause. So I'm going to assign, since it is the longer one, let's assign the Ayase Zushi Miura. So I've got combat exploration and industrial. I need a trade, so let's send the Saitama and Atami. All right, let's launch. And uh, Shken Gates, search for meaning. This one I will do with some lower level ships here. Do we have... So I think we're going to send for combat. We're going to send the uh, CS Nemesis of Ofunama, our raider. And for industrial, we're going to send Saripolu. So that should be combat. 
and oh, there's some ships coming in. Uh, combat and industrial. We'll go Hayama for exploration, Chiyoda for trade, and I need a support vessel. Oh, interesting. Okay, the Kawaguchi. The doomed one is good for... Oh. Exploration and combat. All right. Curious. Exploration and combat. It work reasonably well for... Um, Hmm, maybe. Uh, anyways, let's let's check the trade missions here. Sagamihara, Shinjuku, and Shibuya. Let's send the doomed ship, the ship of the damned, as a support vessel. And since it's a fairly long mission, uh, the Hachioji. All right, two shorter ones. Well, industrial here. Send Isehara Kawasaki. Do I have any more? No, but we'll send Yazrane. And a support with decent industrial. I think that'll be fine. I'll send the Toda. All right, let's do that. And finally, a gem loading inquiry. Difficulty rating is fairly high. So, Kawagoe and Hiratsuka, of course. And we're gonna send Chiba. May as well send uh, Narita and the combat. Let's go with uh, Yamato. Alright. That's done. Let's check out that. Flourishing planet. And there's a space station. Okay, first of all, are we in orbit around it? No, we're not. The Caustic Nightmare. No, thank you. That is the poisonous planet. Okay, the other ones are all in this direction. We've got a storm on the flourishing planet, unfortunately. But that's where we have to go. Still no, still no brood, no vile brood, okay. Not the storm I wanted, but in the world, it's terraforming, terraforming catastrophe, so it's an airless planet. Getting some green from its tenuous atmosphere. All right, golden color. This is beautiful. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What is going on here? This is incredible. Launching drone. I was not expecting this. All these incredible islands in the air. Wow. That's amazing. I want to land on one of these. This one.
All right. Ah. It's not letting me land here. All right. I'm going to have to go down here. It's simply not possible to land on those. Is there some gravitational anomalies with it? Incredible. Oh, well, that one there it looks like it may be lower. I I was not expecting to see a world like this. Launching drone. Wow. Several patches of beautiful green, but also yellow. What an unusual combination of colors and... This is... highly unexpected. Alright, night is falling. things. How big is that? 5.7 meters. Wow. I haven't seen any predators yet. I would like to take a look at this world for a while. Incredible. I need to study this. Where he processes dirt. That's fine. Wow. Interesting rocks, too. Where was it? Hold on. What's glowing blue? We get under this one, or at least somewhat near it. All right. Let's see if the drone can take a look at this. It's got. Plants hanging from it. There's nothing really on top of these. Hold on. Ah, we've got a meteor shower going. This rain is getting a little bit foggy, too. An absolutely remarkable world. I kind of want to... I want to take a look around a little bit. doesn't seem like I can land on these. Probably some sort of gravitational anomaly. Hmm. No. Oh. Are they an illusion? Wait, what's that? 
those trees. Oh, okay. Visibility's uh, getting a little bit low due to this rain. Incredible, though. There was no ocean on this world, was there? I thought there was. Ah, uh, we've got a storm again. No, I can't tell. Alright, let me check. No. There is no ocean. But, very interesting planet. Alright. Kamakrok, please come pick me up here. I'm not going to stay. We're going to keep moving. One thing I want to do is find a world... around the... near the core. I want to find this... like, just some incredible world near the core to claim for the Viator Empire. And I need to go back and visit. I really do need to go back and visit.